Hi, in this video, I will let you know about what is e-invoice and how you can generate e-invoice in Troopers. E-invoice is the electronic invoice for goods and services provided by the business form generated at the government GST portal. The purpose of e-invoice is to avoid the data reconciliation between sellers and buyers under the GST input tax credit system by reducing the mismatch errors. E-invoice is applicable with aggregate turnover limit of 20 crores with effect date from 1st of April 2022. Now, I will let you know about how to generate e-invoice in TruePost. Firstly, we have to enable the option of e-invoice in TruePost. For that, you have to go to the Tools option, select Configuration and Business Configuration. There, you have to type e-invoice in Search Field Caption and enable the option of e-invoice and save the configuration. After this, you have to go to Tools option again, select Integration and select GST File. After selecting this, you will get an option of e-invoice, also the More option where you can select Connect to e-invoice portal. Put your user ID and password for GST in Invoice portal and click on Submit. Now, to generate the IRN, for the invoice, under the e-invoice, you have to click on pending option and select the invoices and click on IRN option to generate and after that select push to IRP. There you will get successfully message of e-invoice successfully generated. Then you can go to the completed status and see the IRN number generated for that invoice. If you click on the invoice number, you can see the item details also. To check the fail upload, you need to go to the fail tab and click on the reasons where you can find the reasons and it can rectify all the reasons. After this, select those invoices and click to generate IRN and select push to IRP. Then it will go to the completed state and IRN will also be generated for that particular invoice. Under completed state, you can see the saved invoices with IRN number. In some cases, you might not be able to see the checkbox option along with invoices. For that, click on click here option and see the particular reasons for that. Rectify your errors and then you have to sync the bill again and you can click on the generate IRN. For uploading manually, you have to click on a particular invoice to export in JSON format. Select export as JSON and click on download. You can see downloaded JSON format is downloaded and you can directly it upload it on IRP portal. Thanks for watching this video. 